Guys, what up? It's Ali here. I'm talking about my day. You're welcome to come join me. It's going to be good. This beautiful backdrop, I know you're wondering, it's tie-dyed by my beautiful mother. And she's very talented, but she's very modest, so she doesn't think it's that great. Drop a like in the comment box. You tell me what you think. Tell me it's great, because I know she wants to hear it's great. Am I great? No. <laughs> I'll stop being obnoxious. Yeah, but I don't give a damn. I'll spill all my coffee. Just you wait. Woo! My day. Simple things happen in my day. Simple things happen in my day. Simple things happen in my day. You hear that hammer? It's because it's hammer time. Well, at the moment, I'm writing like a monster comedy. Well, they're not monsters, but they have to investigate a haunted house full with, filled with monsters. English, English. And yeah, I can't wait to get it published, can't wait to get it finished, can't wait for you guys to read it. And I actually just finished another novel in National Novel Writing Month called Ice Ruins. It's not out yet because I haven't got it published, but as soon as I get it published, I will link that to you all so you can read the fantastical imaginings of my brain. And I'm really excited for today and I hope you guys are as well. Let's get to it. Laundry's done, and now I'm gonna make myself a liter of water to drink, and then I'm gonna hopefully write some things. And if I get distracted writing the things, then I'm gonna go to a coffee shop and write the things because the things gonna get writ. It's gonna get written here. Funny story, guys. I actually bought this drink bottle for my mom because it says "Believe, Achieve, Exceed" on it because I thought it was really positive and empowering, and she got so offended. She's like. I succeed enough already! I work hard! I'm like, yes. Yes, you do. Your work is appreciated. I took it more as like a gym thing where you constantly keep going. But no, she just took it to mean you're not working hard enough. So, reclaiming the drink bottle as my own lawful property. I'll buy something else. I always buy. Oh my god, I've spent so much on Christmas this year. Like if you've spent way too much on Christmas this year. I just love my family! So this is my new writing kind of inspo board. This is some of my friends and family and some of my favorite pics of all time. Like happiness looks gorgeous on you. It does YouTube. It does. These are some of my Rellos. I love them so much. Look at my cute little, oh my God, I should be showing children. Don't show the children to the weirdos on the internet. Okay. But yeah, I love these pictures and some of them we actually took ourselves like that one that's in New Zealand on our holiday and that one's also from New Zealand on our holiday and yeah that's my grandpa sadly passed away he was such a talented guy he could play piano like no tomorrow and this is my oh my god that was my 21st birthday and yeah here are some of my other inspo pics like the cat cutest cat of all time or if you're not a cat person there's the dog cutest dog of all time and mmm mmm I feel like putting this one up at work. Girls don't want boys, girls want equal pay and sick beats. Yeah! So yeah, that's my kind of thing that I spent setting up yesterday. I wish I could have done a like time lapse of it, but I don't know what happened. I'm sorry, I let you all down. But I'm not gonna let you down today. Not today! Oh yeah, and this isn't sponsored, but I got these printed out so cheap for like 15 bucks or 14 bucks because they're 10 cents a shot. And I got it done same day, which is like so cool. And I got the mat because the gloss makes them look bad. And borders, I feel like you're just paying to not get the full photo. So, But I think in retrospect, I might do them square next time, even though you don't get the whole photo. Because if you do them square, then that means 
you can all set them up in like the same vertical or horizontal thing. Whereas if you have a mix, then sometimes you don't have enough vertical. Or, like, especially one thing that annoys me about this wall is that they start going horizontal about there. Just so it lines up, sort of. And yeah, that's how I'm going to fix it. I'm going to print out more. Not that I need more. But, you know, next time I have 10 bucks, why not? I mean, I'm just flooding myself with positivity. But if you close your eyes, does it almost feel like nothing's changed at all? And if you close your eyes, does it almost feel like we've been here before? Hashtag couple karaoke no car. Woo! Yeah, I actually, whoop, whoop, lighting, lighting. Are we lit? Let's get lit. Okay, let's put on another light. Are we or are we not lit? We are not lit. Let's get lit. Let's get lit. Let's get lit. Okay. We are not lit. Where am I exposure at? One thing I wanted to show you guys was I managed to hook my amp up to my laptop so you can play chill music whenever you like. Let me give you a demonstration. Open up iTunes. Yeah! And because it's an amp, you can adjust the bass. Woo, that bass! I think that's about as much I can play without copyright notifications. Yeah. So. Here is my lot. Oh, what am I talking about? Fuck yeah. So what I did is basically if you want to play music off an amp, you can get an extension to attach a speaker thing. And this is just my connecting cord from my Beats headphones. This is just the connecting cord from my Beats headphones. And basically I got this little extension thingy. I got it from JB Hi-Fi, this is not a promotion video, this is just me explaining how I managed to hook my amp up to my speaker, and I plugged that in, and I imagined I initially did it so I could listen to my headphones while I was playing guitar, but then I stopped playing as much guitar. Um, so you can actually listen to your headphones off an electric guitar on a speaker and have really good sound quality by using this little, little thing which only costs like 20 to 50 bucks. And then I plugged it into my MacBook um, with the Beats cord, and now I can play whatever I want through my headphones, which is really cool. And the thing is, if you're going to play it off an amp, don't plug it into the headphones thing because you're using headphones cords. That's what I did at first, it just really fucks everything up, don't do that. You have to plug it into the input channel, so basically you're inputting music from your laptop into a speaker. And then it just plays out usually. It's so cool. It has boosted my productivity or my dance moves by like a million percent. Oh my god. Oh my okay, so I have a bunch of laundry to do. And I'm going to see if I can get this thing connected to my iPad because my camera is out of juice because it has a really low battery life. And... So I need to see if I can connect pain in the ass number one with pain in the ass number two. Let's go. Let's go.